Good morning, everyone. It's me here, Pooh Bear 253, with my newest addition, my sweet little girl here. And she does have a name, and I will be revealing her name towards the middle end of our video. So I am here in the nursery, and we're going to get this sweet little girl changed into her outfit of the day. So this will be her outfit of the day video and I'm going to be putting her in her cute little daisy outfit, spritz it with a little smell good with the daisy pants and a yellow top and I'm just spritzing this with my baby cologne, love that stuff, so I'll let that kind of sit and dry for a minute and i'm going to do her hair for the first time i just kind of brushed it a little bit with the toothbrush but i'm going to apply some of the mohair conditioner that came with her to give it a shot and kind of brush her hair up and we're gonna check her out her hair is beautifully rooted she has a um, i think because um, her artist included the remain the remainder of her mohair conditioner. I mean her uh, her mohair, and I I think was it Slumberland? I think she has Slumberland mohair. Ouch! Ow my finger. Okay. And I just put her little. She had a little magnetic flower that goes right there. And I just put it on her passy keep but I'll probably put it somewhere I just want to put it somewhere safe so I don't so I don't lose it so she still has on her little outfit that came with her I only I only put on her um, I just put a little onesie on her and some little slippers. I hope y'all can see it in there. I just think she's so precious. <clears throat> so I am doing this video on Tuesday. Schools were closed yesterday and today due to the hurricanes that are coming. Uh, Marco, the first. Um, well, it, it wasn't a hurricane. It Well, I don't know if it ever did turn into a Category 1 or not, but it's pretty much falling apart right now. It's at the coast, the Gulf Coast area, and I think it'll be coming this way at some point. Um, so right uh, yesterday, we just kind of went and grabbed some things and did a little shopping because it was sunny all day yesterday. Because you just never can really predict you can never really predict storms and stuff so they try to but but it he's kind of fizzling out but now they're more worried about I think is her name Laura I think the other hurricane is Laura so like before her box opening, I hadn't been here in a while. You know, it's just, it just kind of comes in waves with, uh, for me and the Reborn community. I know towards the beginning, it was just so new and fun. And I was a lot more active in the community back then. But now I've just kind of settled in. You know, I just kind of collect my babies when I collect them and come on sometimes here and there um but like lately i've just been i've just <laughs> i don't know what i've been i've just been here i've just been here and not here i don't know i'm just all over the place i just don't even have an answer for y'all <laughs> but this little girl is so sweet again she was created by um, relaxing with my reborns 
And you can find her over on Instagram. She's amazing to work with. This baby was already in the works and she shared some work in progress pictures of her. And I like messaged her on underneath the post. I'm like, does this baby, will this baby be for adoption? And she was like, yes. And I was kind of going back and forth because, you know, my collection is getting pretty full and whatnot. And, um... Sometimes these full arms, ugh, I'm trying to bend them up. Sometimes they're kind of in the way. <laughs> there we go. But um, what was I saying about me adopting this little cutie? Because I was kind of going back and forth. And as she continued to work on her, I was like, oh, yeah, she's too doggone cute. I must... I absolutely must have her so that's kind of how it all came to be with this little cutie all right let me get her a diaper so I try to reuse diapers because this is the diaper that was on her head and it might be too big and you guys know I don't normally use I don't use the disposables, but let's see, this is a size too. This might be, this may be too big. Let's check it and see. Y'all know I'm all about my cloth diapers, but I do kind of miss the disposables. It's just the only reason why I don't use them is because, you know, I don't want to use them all the time because, in my opinion, I feel it's wasteful. Um, for us as you know reborn collectors the dolls aren't really pooping in them and for us to be using them and throwing them away it's just extra waste that the world doesn't need but that's just my opinion so I um, don't purchase diapers I have purchased like um, some little packs that I just thought was cute some um, little packs that I had gotten from dirt cheap it was just like three in a pack like little um, what's that called little promotion packs and I just got no but I hadn't even used them I just got them just to be a part of my collection so like I said what I'll probably be doing is most mostly I'll probably like I do have an online yard sale that I'm getting together. Like, I don't know when I'm going to actually do it. Um, because I, I need time to do online yard sales. And with me being back at work, you know, time is very limited. So, like, right now, it's just overcast and gloomy we hadn't gotten any thing which is you know we're pretty lucky in that aspect but they're most concerned about the next hurricane that's coming tomorrow I guess I'm happy nothing has you know happened or anything because you know when storms come it's just it's unpredictable you don't know what's gonna what's gonna transpire what's gonna really go down uh, but got a few free or well not not really free because these days that we have to take off because of this we're gonna have to make this time up later this year unfortunately in my opinion like 2020 just has been such such a disappointing year just entirely just too much going on oh I'm so silly a little late I'll after the video I'll take the onesie off I forgot full arms I wasn't paying attention I forgot that this 
little outfit has a little flutter sleeve but it still looks super cute on her oh my goodness actually <laughs> actually it looks very cute on her look at her little outfit y'all oh my goodness this actually looks extremely cute on her oh man there we go i already have her pajama of the night set up i have the the little elephant sleeper that came with her and i'm going to get her dress tonight so i'll be back Hopefully, you know, if the weather's not weather per, weather per, permitting, I'll be back. I think it's a little shirt is just a little bit too long. <laughs> so I have to kind of scrunch it up a little bit. All right, so I want to do her hair. So I think I'm going to, oh my gosh, she is so cute. <laughs> Y'all, look at this little peanut. Look, oh my gosh. She is so cute. Look at this little outfit on her. <laughs> oh my goodness, I just can't. She's so adorable. So, we're going to be right back. I'm going to sit down and play in her hair. And I will be back to show you all how she looks when she's done. And to share her name with you all say so be right back aunties and uncles all right hello everyone i am back i have combed through and brushed my new little one's hair and i just wanted to just kind of show you guys a few little details on her those are her little tootsie wootsies Your cute little toes and what I really like um what Adriana does she kind of gives them kind of like a little dry foot little thing she gives them a couple of dry patches on their little feet <laughs> see like right here like maybe it look like you know a little dry skin or whatever so here's my sweet little girl and I'm gonna go ahead and introduce you all to Mary Gold Amaryllis and that is her name Mary Gold I think uh, Amaryllis <laughs> is gonna pop up on the screen you guys are seeing I'm, I can't even pronounce it right because I had to go through and I was like I like this how do I pronounce it so she's my little my little flower bud so both of her names her first and middle name are names of flowers so marigold is this pretty golden yellow um flower kind of orangey golden yellow and it just kind of reminded me of her beautiful little skin tone and um i just thought um amaryllis i think it's amaryllis like eh, amaryllis um, her middle name I just thought it was pretty so Marigold Amaryllis is this sweet little girl's name so aunties and uncles please welcome her to our reborn family here on YouTube I just kind of brush your little baby hairs down and try to give her a couple little curls like the top kind of curls but the sides are kind of flat so I kind of just smooth Try to smooth the sides down a little bit for her. So that's my sweet little girl and it's wet and I wanna let it dry before I put any hair pretties in because um, I'm new to her and I'm not certain of her mohair. And I have had mohair in the past to kind of bleed a little bit. So you just wanna be kind of cautious of that. So until I learn her mohair and see what it does, I will experiment with that a little bit later. So, I just got little fingers. I really like this hand. It looks like she's kind of holding my hand a little bit. At some point, I'm gonna have to come on here and just kind of sit and chat with y'all for a little bit, but I don't know. I think I just, I don't know. That's just not something I really do very often. 
anymore. But this little girl is so sweet. And um, if y'all didn't check out her box opening, her box opening is up on my channel. I uploaded, I filmed it Saturday um, and uploaded it. Wait, was it Saturday or Sunday? I think I filmed it Saturday and it uploaded Sunday because I was having difficulty with it. It was like taking forever for it to upload and I had stopped it and then restarted it because it didn't look like it was doing anything. But it eventually uploaded at some point in the middle of the night, like Sunday morning, Saturday night time-ish. I'm just sitting here fussing over her. I think she's such a sweet little peanut. But like I said, she's my little flower bud. So, she's my little blossom. So, like, I think butterflies and floral theme will probably kind of be her theme. So, I'll probably find, like, I'll probably try to find, like, um, like more, f dress her in more floral outfits to match her name. So that's it for Little Miss Marigold. Um, I don't have a nickname for her just yet. But I just, you guys know how much I like my unique names. And I just thought Marigold um, Amaryllis would be perfect for her. So and I just kind of thought of it. Because I was like, I was like, oh, my little, my little flower bud. And then I just looked up um, flower names. Just looked up a few flower names and that's how I came up with her name. Look at, look at this little thing. She's so cute, y'all. But that's it, y'all. I hope you all enjoyed her outfit of the day video. Let's move Pooh over here so you can see her outfit. There we go. She's gorgeous. She really is. Like, if you guys haven't um, checked out Relaxing with my Reborns on Instagram, check her out. She makes very very beautiful babies she makes caucasian babies and ethnic babies i haven't seen like a darker tone ethnic baby from her but she will she does make like the this tone of ethnic babies and i think this little girl just came out so cute look at her the camera loves you darling the camera loves you oh yes she's pretty so um I kind of switched up a little bit in the nursery, just a tiny bit. This isn't sideways anymore. I pushed Aria and Dason out some. Let me unplug y'all so we can take a quick little spin. My little rug that was in here, I took out. I've been struggling, like finding room for stuff. Y'all won't be seeing no hauls or nothing because. There is like literally nowhere to put anything up in this piece. Seriously. So that's my um for sale. And like I my husband and I have decided to no longer celebrate Fourth of July. It's now just my mom's birthday to us from now on. We will be celebrating Juneteenth from now on. So I if you guys liked any of my Fourth of July outfits that I had for um my dolls that you saw them in that's all that's in there um selling that stuff and see if i can find some cute juneteenth things for my babies and i just i don't i was i moved that stuff up there because the bug spray man came so i try to get as much stuff off the floor so he can spray real good and stuff i got that outfit sitting out for um For Lucian I was toggling back and forth and I chose the outfit he has on now and then his next outfit will be this like summertime my babies just wear onesies of course that's the wintertime stuff up there uh, some winter jackets and my little outfit I just showed y'all for um a Nico is up there and I got her little pink sweater right there because it's just no room for stuff and my little box for my little Behringer baby I put up there but like I say it is like <laughs> and I gotta get um because she's gonna be chilling here that's gonna be her new spot 
Um, but I need a pillow. She needs a pillow. So I need to hit up my aunt again and get this right here cut into some smaller uh, pillows like this pillowcases like I did with the purple one um but right now I just got it folded up I hadn't like given it to her yet to chop up for me so I can make her another so what I can do is the boys will have the black and the girls will have the purple for right now but like I say the babies are all just kind of rocking their their onesies and stuff I kind of switched this up a little bit. Gaius was over here, so I moved my pillows and my little um, triceratops over here. And I just scooched over the, the little play mat, and that's where Gavin chills out. That's his, I don't know if I ever told you guys, but his name is Gavin Michael. That's two of my students that, <laughs> their first names that two of my students that I used to teach so he just looks like a Gavin to me Gavin Michael he hangs out on the Pooh mat and I got my little Winnie the Pooh family here and I recently got a Nico dress because her auntie sent her some shoes and some clothes but I try to use the clothes in um in order from when I buy them so I bought this little unicorn outfit for her a while back so she has her hair up in a little I did her little pony. I just kind of just enjoy my babies on my own nowadays. I don't really come on YouTube too much. The only reason why I'm on here now is because I'm OCD and all my babies I have have to have their outfit of the day in pajama, in pajama of the night. So that's the only reason why I'm on here now. She's got her kitty and her auntie Adriana sent her some unicorn shoes and some sparkly pink shoes. So. She was like, mom, change me. I want to match my unicorn shoes. Uh, so like, yeah. And these socks, when I tell you, I absolutely love these socks. I have these socks in yellow and I think I bought them in white and I have them in pink. Those little socks from Pet Pet are so freaking adorable. Oh, I love those socks. And I just moved guys over here. I just, every now and then I'm always moving and switching stuff around. And I just kind of moved my little rug out here so you can actually see it. You never see it. And here are the twins rocking their yellow. Cause I always be saying like, I don't never put my babies in any yellow. I barely buy yellow. So those are some old outfits that I've been had. <laughs> and there's my sweet little. Um, that's Gaius. And your name is. <laughs> Dang it! I forgot. I forgot his name. Uh, Arden. There's my Arden. <laughs> Arden Matthias. So just, you know, I got drawers out because I was brushing and combing and snipping hair a little bit. So let's put this stuff up. I had it sitting there. So y'all can hang out with me while I put this up and then we'll be ending this video. When I have new babies, I like brush their hair with the Elmo and stuff to check their hair out don't want any bleeding just in case you never know all right so spritzing her hair up there we go oh it hurts where oh here it is and where did the top go i thought i said the top man I, i'm always losing tops that is Something I'm always, always losing the tops. Oh no, look, there it is. I was smart this time. I put it somewhere where I'd see it. So I got all kind of, so this was mohair condition I got from Tanya. This is for Orly. And then I just bought this at the Dollar Tree because I hadn't seen the Tangler spray in there forever. This, ooh, this is for Marigold. This came with her. And this is my own concoction of just um, of uh, conditioner and water that I just made. So that all different kinds in there. And push that in there, nice and neat. And all my stuff back there, my extra little unicorn blanket and stuff. I just have entirely, way entirely too much stuff. 
up in here so I try to keep it as simple as I can but let's end the video on who this video was about and it was my sweet little marigold so do y'all like her name I love her name I was like because my husband I was like okay hubby you're up you got to name the new baby I said I was thinking like of a flower name that starts with M he's like the only flower name I could think of starts with M is marigold and then I looked up and saw Magnolia. Her name was almost Magnolia. So I actually have another baby that I will be getting at, well, not anytime soon, but I will be getting another baby um, with Adriana. Like it's probably gonna be a while from now after the house is paid off and, and stuff. But she, wink, wink, like she got, I asked her for a specific kit and unbeknownst to me she bought the kit I, I was just asking if she had the kit in her possession and she didn't and I didn't even know the kit had came back in stock and it was in stock and like next thing I know she sent me a picture of look who's here I was like oh I didn't know you were actually gonna buy the kit <laughs> so she actually bought this kit for me so it's for me she has it I told her to hide it put it way in the back I don't want to get that doll I want you to paint that baby for me at some point so maybe i would name that baby magnolia so marigold and magnolia oh my gosh so cute and like i'm not i, I guess i will kind of keep it a secret because <laughs> i'm about to say it's a, i'll also say it's a very if once i say this it's a very very popular bountiful baby kit that's all i gotta say y'all already know who it is very very popular that was out of stock for a while and then she's back in stock so and i absolutely a lot of people have this kit I love this kit to death and I'm just trying to wait on it to kind of die down a little bit I love this baby a lot of people have this baby um but that baby is just that was just the cutest real born like that's like the number one real born in my in my opinion say no offense baby <laughs> because you are uber cute too so you are a close second <laughs> a very close second um but i want to get that baby at some point so maybe i would name her magnolia but this is marigold um a mary um, a mar wait shucks um, i can't even pronounce her last name y'all forgive me a marilis uh a a, a something like that i'm saying it wrong but um <laughs> a, a, a mar a <laughs> whenever i say it right i know i'm saying it right that's bad. Like you didn't name your baby something you can't even see it yourself. <laughs> Amer Ameritless. Wait, that's not right. Oh gosh. Cause I'm looking at the name in my brain. Ameritless. Amer Amerless. Something. Y'all, my brain broke. Anyway, we are watching out for hurricanes over here. My brain ain't all the way there. That's it. Welcome Marigold. I'm not even gonna say her last name because I can't even pronounce it. I'm crazy. Anyway, I'm out of here. Mwah. Peace. Bye bye. And I'll see you guys in her outfit. Oh, in her pajama of the night. I'll be filming that a little later today. Let me edit this and upload it. Talk to you guys later. Bye.